What's up, my be lovelies? You guys, today we are eating some La Rosas. Finally, you actually, we had, I had it. I tasted it like a couple of days ago. I don't know, Darius don't remember his experience. But y'all, when I say this stuff is bomb, it is bomb. It was so, so, so good and so fresh. So I'm gonna get to saying grace. Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus, I thank you for this food that we are about to receive. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. So, what I got is spaghetti and meatballs. And then I got me some, a calzone, which I've never tasted before, with some soup. I love a zone. Do we, are we up close enough? Yes. Can you come up a little bit more? Am, am I? That's yeah, I got scoot up. Who? You? Them. They got to scoot up? Yeah. Darius, scoot it up more. No, they don't need it. Because we fade far back. Uh, there you go. That's better, ain't it? A little girl. bit. Anyways. So we got the calzone. Calzone soup. I had a chicken, a uh, Philly chicken. Calzone? Mm-hmm. Mmm. Mmm. Knew it was gonna happen, so. Um, you saying? Mmm. Mmm. -mm. That's really good. Dumped in some soup. This is cream of dumpling soup, y'all. Sorry. Look, this is bomb. It really is. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. And so, this spaghetti comes with, um, you can get it with meatballs or you can get it without the uh, meatballs. And it comes with garlic bread or breadsticks. Mmm. You know what I realized? Mm. Hot sauce is something I can't share. Why? Like, you I can share, share with me. the family, which is oh. already a stretch. Mmm. But I mean, like, when about, people ask you for your hot sauce, it's uh, weird to me. When they say, hey, can I just have a little bit? Because mm. you don't know what to do with the hot sauce. And she's pulling that out of a mystery purse. It's, just, I don't know, it could be an elixir. And you'd never know. No. Huh? No. no let me see. Oh. Yeah. Oh, never mind. I don't know what that is. I really don't, but it looks like a sausage, and if it is, mm. a sausage. La Rosa's is going out of business. Mm. That's some really good food. That really do. I like them a lot. And they deliver fresh. You like it? One second. Really? Don't take that long. Mmm. Could have a tad bit more sauce. But I, I think that's because I haven't gotten to the edges yet. Also, I feel like when you um, order thin crust, you want it to be crunchy. Or like, you know, at least it's a firm crust, like a cracker, like a thin crust. Mm -hmm. This is not that. This is very doughy, like chewy. And you don't like that? Well, I don't prefer it right now. It's just wasn't mm. I, wasn't what I was expecting. I 
I've got the meat deluxe, y'all. Pizza. It's good for me. Mmm. Y'all, let me tell y'all what happened to yesterday. Tell me all experience there, Joe. But Darius, y'all know, y'all saw that video yesterday. Oh, in the car. Huh? Hmm? Yeah. What is that? I said horrible. I know. It was. Anyways, <laughs> y'all, Dewey's in the car, right? So this book bong is gonna be dedicated to Betsy. Because we lost her yesterday. We really did. Mm-hmm. And it was horrible. But I guess it was a horrible thing, but I guess a blessing. I don't know. That's not a good story. <laughs> Everyone, before we begin, my single, I have a final date. I posted it on my Instagram. Mm -hmm. my, my new single will be out on August 10th. Um, you can already pre-save it to your Spotify playlist right now. If you go to my Instagram, everyone follow me on Instagram, first of all. Okay. Um, it's in the description. Mm -hmm. I put it there. So no hard to say it again. Um, it's at Darius underscore Gaskin, but you can also go in the description. Um, and yeah, so I um, I'm releasing that song on August 10th, and it's gonna be everywhere. Hopefully, I pushed the date out. The song is finished now, obviously, but I pushed the date out uh, like a couple weeks so it ta so the distributors have time to put it out on like Apple Music and other mm. places so it takes a bit of time for them to like screen it and stuff like that and whatever so um so i pushed it out i was gonna do it this friday but or i don't know what when this video is coming out but i was gonna do it on the fourth of uh this video be i probably be out tomorrow August. i'll do it tomorrow but i um it wouldn't have had enough time to get everywhere and i don't want to say oh it's out now and everyone's going wait where is it out because i don't have it on my stuff whatever mm -hmm. so yesterday i was finishing up the song at the studio, mm -hmm. so I um, after our, our um, mukbang, which was the uh, where did we go? We went to um, Blazes. Blazes, and we did a car mukbang. We did one. a car mukbang. It was in my car, 2005 Mercedes E Class something. I don't know some other number, whatever. Mm -hmm. And I promise she was just in, in good condition. She's always well. She she's she's, never she's on the older side. She's <laughs> on the other side, but she's never let anybody down. You know, she's just been she she was getting a so little. So that one time, she got sick. Yeah, she's coughed a few times, <laughs> but nothing you know, nothing traumatizing. Um. So yeah, I was um. I was he dropped me off. Y'all saw yeah. him drop me off. I dropped yeah, I dropped her off at the house right, and I left. Um, and it takes about thirty something minutes for me to get to the studio. So I'm driving, and I said, "Let me get in the fast lane," because I was running. I was wasn't running late, but I just wanted to be there a little bit early, you know. So I'm driving, and I'm getting in the fast lane. I get up to like seventy or something, or whatever, you know. And I'm like, maybe like twelve minutes into the drive, and all of a sudden, well, first I was thinking it'd be horrible. If mm -hmm. I got into a car crash, like a car accident or something, I was for some reason I was just thinking that I was like, what if, what if? I don't know why I was thinking that, but I was. And all of a sudden, all of a sudden, I heard Booka Booka. <laughs> I heard Booka Booka, and I looked in my rearview mirror, and there was smoke for miles. And the when I heard Booka Booka. <laughs> I don't know, but the back of the car like did a, did a nice uh, a skip and a hop and a jump. <laughs> and when the smoke cleared, I saw 13 turn signals to get out of the lane. Everyone was swerving into other lanes, and I'm doing this. I'm doing this. I said, "Oh my god! Oh my god!" So I said, mm -hmm. "What just happened?" So I'm still driving, and my heart is like stopping. Like I just see like a whole bunch of people getting out of the lane behind me, mm -hmm. and I'm like, "Oh my god! Oh my god! That was me." And the, this is Final they're Destination. All that. Yep. This is Final Destination, and they're trying to get out of the lane. And so then I heard Booka Booka again, and I said, "Uh, uh I said it's time to pull over." <laughs> so I pulled over. Mind you, I need to get to my studio session. 
I pulled over and I literally didn't know what to do, so I'm calling my dad, I'm calling my mom, I said, Mom, you have to come get me. I need to send you my location, because this car is going booka, booka, booka. And I thought he was in an accident. I said, oh my God, this boy called me. I hope he was not in no accident. He was like, Mom. I'm like, OMG. It was, ugh. and so then, oh my gosh, it was a lot. So then I called my dad or whatever, uh -huh. and he finally called back. And mind you, I'm sitting in, on the shoulder of the road waiting right. for my mom to come. So I'm, I, I send her the address or whatever. And so I called my dad. I said, Dad, um, I need you to come fix this car or something like that. It's, it's, I told him, I went booka booka. And so booka, booka. he came. He came like right, right after my mom showed up. He came after or whatever. And, but we had five already minutes. left. Right. No, not five minutes. Like we were Three up minutes. in the street. Yeah. It was not that long. It was like a minute and some, whatever. And like we, he he saw us pull off, right? And so, we're, get the key. We're, he called he called us and he's like, I hope you guys left me the key. And I didn't. <laughs> I didn't leave him the key. You know why? Because I didn't think that. I mean, I shouldn't. I don't know why I didn't leave him the key. Because I just thought it would be stupid to leave the key in the car. I don't know why I just thought it would be stupid to leave the key in the car okay. and have the doors unlocked. Okay. Whatever. So we're driving, and he said, I hope you left the key. So we had to, of course, you know, it's hard to get off the highway when you're uh -huh. on and go the opposite way. So we had to get off at the nearest exit, and then my dad had to follow us, and then we had to, he had to catch up with us. Then we had, I had to do the, a, a, a key toss, hand off, and throw it out the window. No, I'm kidding. But we, I, I had to give him the key. So then we went to the, uh, the studio, and I was already late. It was by this time it was already my session had started, and but luckily he um, so I was usually doing another session and he said that there was like I don't know whatever he was busy, so good thing, um, but anyway, so yeah, I um, apparently while I was in uh, the um, the session which was like a four hour session or something, when I got out. I get these messages from my dad, and it's 14 pictures. And I was so confused as to why he was sending me these pictures. And they're pictures of the car, right? And... What did you think? Did you think you did something to the car? No, no. I thought, okay, so you know how like when you like, whenever you give something to a, a company or whatever, and they're doing some kind of maintenance on it, you want to like take pictures or whatever, just so that when it comes back, you know it's in like the good condition mm -hmm. that it was supposed to be, mm -hmm. or like the condition you gave it to them in, right? Mm -hmm. So he sent me 14 pictures, and I thought he was sending me pictures of the car while I got in the tow truck. Oh, that's what, we, we missed that out. He called the tow, tow company to come pick up the, right. the truck the car. So I thought he was sending me pictures to like say, oh, this is how the car looks beforehand. But then you think no, it was but your listen, car? Okay. But I was looking at the pictures, and the, the, the hood, <laughs> I thought like the hood had like pop, like I thought he like opened we the hood. We gotta show y'all pictures of it. I thought he just like opened the hood. So I'm examining the pictures and I was so confused on why the hood was open. Like it wasn't open, but it was like, it was like if you opened the hood and then just like rested it down, but it didn't close all the way. You so got so far. Yeah, there was a little gap. Mm -hmm. And I was just so confused. And so I'm scrolling and all of a sudden I see the headlight and she's doing this. <laughs> <laughs> And I said, what happened to the car? I'm going to show you what he said. And I screamed. Yeah, I did. Y'all should have saw me. When I have got the message, this is the thing. My husband called the tow company, the tow truck. Go show him first. So I get pictures like this of the car. You see that it's just raised up a little bit. And I'm just a little confused as to why the hood is open. <laughs> and then I scroll over and I see this picture. And the headlight, she's busted. And I said, oh my God. I said, what happened? And there's like paint chips falling everywhere. And I was so confused. Uh, and so then um, I said, what happened to the front? And then basically what had happened was the tow guy. You saw him? Oh, okay. Go ahead. The tow guy um, didn't put on the straps right. So I guess one of the the straps had snapped while they were pulling off, and the car went booka booka again for the third time that day, and she was all dismantled in the front. <laughs> yeah, and I don't really know the other yeah, the part of the story. Yeah, it was bad. This is what out. happened. Okay, my yep, my husband had called the tow company. He called the tow company. They came and got the car. They strapped the put the car up on the towing truck, 
and they've secured it in the back. Somehow, the front, they secured it, but when they pulled up, okay, mind you, they pulled out before my husband. So they up, up, you know, a ways on the expressway. So then my husband, he tells them to take them to take the car to the Mercedes dealership because we was gonna go get it fixed. We, my husband, pulls off a little bit after them, and once he pulled off, he seen them pull to the side, over to the side of the road, and he see his car. And he see black smoke again, and he's like trying to see. He going seventy miles, uh, you know. Seventy miles an hour. He looking like, what is going on? So he pulls over. He actually, he didn't pull over. He actually kept going and said, you know what? I'm gonna meet them at the Mercedes Benz because what I think I saw is that my car got messed up in the front from them not, you know, placing it on the tow truck correctly. So we like, he like, okay. So he's at the the uh, the Mercedes Benz place, y'all, waiting for his car to get delivered there from the tow company for hours do you hear me it took like a couple of hours for them to show up so when they show when the when the guy showed up no not nate called the tow company he said my car is not here yet i'm wondering what's going on what's taking so long and then the lady said oh uh he's at the gas station he'll be pulling up in probably like 12 minutes he's at the gas station getting gas and my husband was like oh okay so this is what, and he didn't know for sure if the car was um, not, you know, ruined and messed, messed up or anything. So he didn't want to get the guy in trouble and say it's messed up when he really don't know if it's messed up because he was going 70 miles per hour and looking at this, you know, looking at the truck to the side. You really can't really see what's going on. You could just, you know, assume, assume or, you know, speculate what's going on. So he, uh, that guy, y'all. <laughs> Oh no, actually the lady called him, called him back again, text him again, text him and said, oh, he's like five minutes away. He's pulling up right now in a minute. And so Nate said, okay, so Nate made sure he was there by the garage so he'd be able to see him pull up with our car. Man, y'all, when I say he pulled up, my husband's mouth dropped. Like the car was dismantled. You do, do you understand me? It was crazy. So the, the guy is on the phone with the tow, tow company, and I know he was sick with it. The guy was sick with it. You know, he was probably nervous, didn't know how to, you know, say that this car got, you know, messed up while I was in my care or whatever. But he called lady. He was still lying to them. He was like, well, uh, I was getting gas, and, uh, and my husband was trying to talk to him and to tell him the truth. He said... Dude, he said, the damage is already done. Just tell her the truth. It's okay. Things happen. Tell her the truth. Tell her the truth. He keep on telling him the guy told him the truth. He's scared and nervous as ever. So he finally broke down and told the lady the truth of what really happened. And all they can do is say, okay, man, sir, we're going to give you an insurance claim. We're going to fix it. You know, try to get an insurance claim on your vehicle. And so they will have to fix everything that's... You know, and I'm, I'm sure the car was going to probably be totaled, you know, right. because it's an older Mercedes. But just the fact of it being just something that happened on the road that Darius said something, what, fell out? I swear something fell out. Or whatever happened, the case may be, we was going to get it fixed, and now I think the car is just totaled because on, on the tow company, so now they owe us money, so we're just going to end up basically getting a new vehicle. Or... Yeah. Won't be a Mercedes. There is old big no, it won't be a Mercedes. There is old big vehicle. Yeah. I'm not getting that key back. It won't happen. Because it's gonna be Darius car. I have I have a new car, you guys, but I've never I haven't shown it yet. Which should we show it after this? Huh? Doing this video? I have I games to play. Really? I'm just kidding. But anyway I'll show it after this. I can't believe on another And she was video. just about to go on tour. She yeah, really was. she was. Betsy was just about to go on tour. She didn't even know her life was just beginning. She, she had a new, a new clean page, she had a new did. owner, and she was about to uh, do a video. She was she starting was. her YouTube channel. Yeah. She really like everyone was waiting for like to see a tour of her. Yeah. And she was just about to start a career. And the, the tragic things always happen to the youngins.
Yeah, I promise you, y'all, we had just said in that video, we're going to give you that a tour of Darius' car, his vehicle, because it's a nice, it is, a, it was a nice Mercedes. I don't care how, you know, it was older, but it was really nice. The, 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 seat, the seats were very clean, you know, and leather seats and had all the amenities. Everything was working. So I was going to give you a tour and, you know, you see Darius driving around. It was a nice car for a 17-year-old. And I just can't believe it died. I mean, dead. It killed over. Three times over. I said, Booker Booker. That's so sad. But I, I, I can't am. Believe it. Uh, I was so scared in that moment. Like, I just didn't know what to do. I froze on the highway going you seven miles an hour in the fast lane. Because the car went Booker Booker. And I looked behind me, and everyone is getting out of the lane. I thought the parts were just coming out of the bottom. I actually don't know what happened. Maybe I ran over something. Cause when I looked at the thing, it didn't nothing. You like, sure you didn't run over that tire? No, mom. That tire was way down. I stopped and. Cause sometimes I thought you had a blowout. No, yeah, cause she thought she saw a tire uh, skin or whatever that you see on the highway. She said, I thought it. That's you got you had a flat tire, mom. If I saw the flat tire, the thing, I would have known. But it, no, and no, I didn't stop that that quickly. I um. It went booka booka. I saw smoke. Booka didn't booka. know what to do. My hands were shaking. I was doing this. My mm -hmm. hands were shaking. And then I looked behind. The cars are getting out of the lane. I'm going, what just happened? Should I continue to drive? Do I exit? I was trying to see if I should get off on the nearest exit. I'm glad I did it because that exit was miles away. I promise that exit was so long when we tried to take it. But anyway, so then... It would start again, would it? No, it wouldn't. So then I, I um, so I said, okay... Should I just go down the road? And so then it went book a book again. And I said, I gotta stop. So I pulled over to the side of the road and I'm looking around. I'm so, I don't like being uh, in the public eye on the highway. That's so embarrassing. And everybody looking at you. Yeah, when I was just passing you by. And there's someone saying, Mom, hurry up and get here because I don't want the cops to pull over. Um, I didn't want to hear because you know there's more I attention. I just feel uncomfortable <laughs> when the police say, oh, What's your business here? And I gotta tell them my, my car went book a book a. <laughs> What's a book a book a? That's what it said, Booka Booka, in the back. Anyways, y'all. And I screamed. But anyway, so I tried, okay, so I turned the car off, right? Because the car was working. It was driving. I wonder if it was coasting. I swear it was working fine. When I was driving, it, I thought it was working fine after it went Booka Booka the first time. And then it went Booka Booka the second time. I said, I don't think I should be driving. So I just stopped. It's not like the car was stopping or whatever. It seemed like it was fine. So I pulled over. I took the key out of the ignition. And I tried to put it back in. And... It did not start for, like, the car didn't move. It didn't blink. I turned it, and, that, like, I didn't even hear the... It was dead. I didn't even hear anything. It was his last breath, Darius. It was her last breath. And she just showed just so much, you know, rejuvenating skin. And I just, she was radiating the other day. And I just really didn't know that no one, this is a tragic, tragic death. And no one knew this was going to happen. We did not know that was her destiny. We really didn't. It just, it just really just. Especially the, the tow truck. I mean, completely tow her. And that's up. not, mm -mm, no, because they all, they never gave you enough for what the car was worth to you. Not that, not okay. It might have a value price, but they never gave you enough of what the car was worth to you. Really? It's just, it's still a Mercedes Benz, even though it was an older right. car. It still is a Mercedes Benz, and they might give me however many thousand for it. However, um. Yeah, many thousands of dollars for it, but still that thousand dollars is not going to give me another Mercedes. Right. It's going to give me a a, a, a Rhea. Mm -hmm. It's going to give me a Leah. A Leah. It's going to give me. It's going to give me a Rhea. <laughs> it's going to give me a um a, a, a Ron Fia. a Rondi. Uh, yep, 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 yep. It's yep. going to give me a Pontiac, and I really just wanted the the vintage Mercedes. <laughs> There's well, you can't now. None of so this is my I don't fault. know what we go. What, None of this is my fault. He got to get a car, so we definitely be looking for another one. But who knows how long it's gonna take for the insurance company? It's so sad and all that. So we gotta go and do what we gotta do. They better. I don't know. Maybe she was gonna be dead anyway. She was on her. Maybe she was on her last leg. And yeah, but we could have got her fixed. It wasn't that bad. But she had an attack, a heart attack. She really did. No, she really. First of all, she literally had one of those she had a moments heart attack. of she died on. A, I mean, she had a heart attack, and then she thought she was gonna go to like maybe when you start maybe bedside in, assistance. Right. She was on life hospice. support. She thought she was going to be on hospice. Yeah. And they were wheeling her away, and literally she knows she's gonna have another heart attack. 
on the way to hospice care. Yeah, no. It was horrible. It was like the ambulance had a, a, a an accident while they was trying to take care of her, and it was done. Her destiny That's was That's horrible. Over. I'm suing. I really should sue. Sue so what? Maybe should get more money. I'm traumatized. Darius, you ain't suing. They're giving you money for your thing. I'm, for your car. I'm traumatized. Anyways. I'm traumatized. So y'all, I'm going to show y'all my car. I keep on saying that. Look. I can't believe the car went I don't have a car anymore, guys. Just like that. Yeah, and that's bad because now, I, every time I think, I'd be like, man, he can't. Because my husband got to say, man, let Darius can go get it, pick us something to eat. Uh, 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 us up something to eat. And I'm like, no, he ain't got no car. I can take yours sometimes, right? No, you can't. Why can't I take yours? You, I lost, you done lost your mind. I can take your car sometimes. Never. Why not? I'm just going to get your Kia back. No, I'm not taking the, the Rhea. I'm not getting the Rhea. Yeah, we had took his Kia in because uh, we, traded we, in. we we traded in because I paid I paid my car and I don't have a car note. So when I bought my car, I don't have my car note or anything, which is a good thing. But we put we was gonna have four cars in the the car area and we didn't need four cars. That's so I took his car and um, gave it to them, traded it in. And uh, they gave me a thousand for it, and then Betsy died. And but the car is still there, she and the car lost. was working. So I'm thinking. No, I'm not thinking that. <laughs> the car was working, but her brakes were gone. She was. She, she would have got mad, but she would have got fixed though. She. She could have got fixed, yeah, but she just still. I don't know. There's no. What I've is, already is separated my school? ties. And I kind of like, you know how you like when you... No. You kind of like when you know that you're not going to like... When you're starting a new chapter of your life. No, Darius, you're not and starting a new chapter. Let, like, what chapter are you starting? Listen, uh, when you start a new chapter of your life, you just like know that your old life's done. So you like tell everybody in your old life like what you've always thought about them. I cursed her. And I said, you know what? I'm getting Mercedes. And I was mocking her. I was dancing. I did a ritual. I was dancing around the car. And I hit her. I kicked her a few times. And then I said, I hate you. I hate you. I said, I have a brand new car. And then Betsy died. And now I can't go back, Mom. There is. You Betsy's go back, dead. You I not, can't I'm go not, back. There is. I'm going to you this. You're not driving no Mercedes. Obviously. Mom, I know it's not going to be Mercedes. But I'm not going back to that Kia Rio. There is. You're going to have a Kia. You're going to have something cheap. I'm not going back to the Kia. Watch. I'm not going back to the kids. There is. What money are you coming with? We're starting to go for me. Okay, let them, I'm going to let them heat you up in the comments. Actually, you know what? You could help fund the new car if you go listen to my single on August 10th. Um, okay. It's coming out, you know, and um, you'll hear snippets here and there. Um, when are going to give a snippet? Not now. When did you? When are you supposed to give a snippet? I don't know. The, I'd be bad at this thing because if it was my song, y'all would have heard a snippet already. No. That's not how you do it. No. You have to wait. No, I might give them hurrah. Think, That's not that. in the song. No. I'm not doing that. Why would anybody ever get used to it? Like, okay, ooh, I kind of like that. Just a little verse. Like, okay, I'm looking forward to that song. No. That's not what people do. You don't give him a little verse. I don't know what that means. <laughs> you don't give him a little verse. I thought you would give him a verse. I don't know why. Anyways, that's crazy. But he's gone. Okay, y'all. I don't know. What time is it? What time is it? Is? 29 minutes. Okay, y'all. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Share this video with anyone. Everyone let them know what your girl is doing on the channel. And I'll see you guys tomorrow with another video. I love you guys so, so, so much. Don't forget to stay safe, stay blessed. Peace. And y'all, I'm going to do a... Uh, Follow me on Instagram. Tour on this car. It's going to be a generic tour. A generic one, y'all. Because I don't know everything about this car. Was... Yeah, I don't even know about this car like that. So, I'm just going to go out there with my vlogging camera and do it. Also, it's trying to... Uh, some of y'all say y'all want to see me cook for Nate. What I cook for Nate in the evening. So I'm just trying to vlog some of that too. So I'll see y'all when y'all see y'all. Bye. Come listen to my single. It's coming out August 10th. I did it three times this video. They get it. They get it. It'll be in the next video and the video 29. after that. It does. It's 29.57. Dang.